Welcome back. How about jumping into 34 degree water to get your day going? Welcome to the Fargo Polar Plunge. Freezing for a reason. Three, two, one. Give it, give it now. Fred is definitely freezing for a reason. Around 45 people joined Fred Flintstone taking a dive at the Polar Plunge in Fargo today at the Ramada Plaza and Suites. Those who took the plunge went for best costume, belly flop, and most money raised. And some familiar faces hosted the event, Lisa and Kyle from the Valley today. The event supports local athletes in the Special Olympics. Absolutely. All the money that's raised here today stays right here in North Dakota um, and funds the athletes that participate here in Fargo and across the state. Plungers raised over $8,000, all for the Special Olympics. And you may be noticing more cars, people and at restaurants and busy hotels around the Fargo area this week. It's all because of the state hockey tournament going on at Shields Arena. The Fargo-Moorhead Visitors Bureau says this is only the start to sports tournaments in the area. Just last year, the three-day Squirt International Hockey Tournament brought in more than $2.8 million to the Valley. That's what the Visitor Center hopes continues. And it's not only helps the sporting community, but local businesses and restaurants as well. Fargo's just growing like crazy, so it gives us a good name and it kind of puts us on the map. The last weekend of March, Fargo is set to host the Sweet 16 for the NCAA West Regional Men's Hockey. There's actually a bidding process, and Fargo beat out places like the Twin Cities and even towns in Georgia.